Hello everyone. So, <clears throat> as I promised, I will do one reading each week or two readings each week. We'll see, you know. This is for everyone of my BTS army. I'm going to choose one of our cuties to give you an advice. You know, we haven't done this in a long time. So, here we go. This is first one is up is Jiminy, you know. So, we're going to see what kind of an advice Jiminy is giving and also what he wants to tell you, okay? So, Jimin, there we go. <laughs> we have a child coming out. That's so cool, you know. Oh my gosh, I love it. So, <clears throat> this card says playfulness, lightheartedness, innocence, and wonder. Number 18. I really feel that whoever needs to hear this, guys, um, you're not feeling really good and Jiminy wants that you focus on your inner child letting your inner child play um you know being happy um you know in general playing having fun so we're gonna see what is the message and I'm using my BTS tarot deck oh my gosh everything is falling down So, wait, I have to get all my cards. I really love this picture of Jiminy. It's so cool. Really love it. So, I have to get the two cards that fell down. So, guys, let's do this reading. So, we're going to see what this is all about. First card up is <laughs> Jiminy. Yeah, as I said, you're like in this mood like, where do I get money? Where do I get money? I want merch, you know? Look at my... <laughs> look at how I edited this card. It's like crazy, you know? <laughs> it's like Jiminy saying, hello, you know, I want this, I want that. Um, but I'm not satisfied because I don't have all this, you know? I don't have all this. What else? The Six of Swords. Yeah, moving on, guys moving on from this feeling of not being enough you know also moving on from this feeling of lack you know this is exactly a feeling of lack it's also asking well where's my one you know look at jiminy's face it's like he want everything it's like you want your one you want to be happy it's like basically looking for happiness and wanting you know the what is it called gosh wanting it but not knowing how to get it and you need to move on from this feeling of lack it's like a feeling of lack that you're having yeah because you need to see that um, you already started something this is why this card is in black and white I edited it like this and what's coming through here is you already planted the seed to something you started something and um, it's going into the right direction, you know, it says extra life. It's going into the right direction, but you know, it's it's not there yet. And that's probably because it's black and white, um, why you feel this lack energy. I really feel this card fits so good to this card, like perfect. You get another one for this side. Yeah, look at this. This is the, about the one. The one you want to find, the king of pentacles, your golden prince. Look at our Tangi as being the golden prince. Isn't he beautiful? Also, the king of pentacles. Um, you could be um, a Capricorn, a Taurus or a Virgo. You know, I just want to say this. But it's about feeling happy and moving away from this lack energy. And this could be something else for every one of you, you know. I want to look with the Lenormand now. I want to look into the matter. What is this Ten of Pentacles? Because this is the most important thing. What is this Ten of Pentacles here? Jiminy. Whoa. It's almost the same color as always. The journey, you know, the path. That's 
the path and you're walking this path for some time now. You're walking this path of lack energy for some time now and you're asking yourself, well, when will this, look at this card, when will this path ever end? Because you know how I edit it? I look at pictures. You see, this is a picture. So you are on this path for some time now. You already have pictures, um, you know, from yourself where you started this. That's why I said you started something. You planned it a new life. Um, something was new in your life. You started something new. But and you, you, you're on this for some time now. And it's not changing. And that's why you are in this lack energy, because you're saying, well, I want to go where it's golden. I want to arrive here. That's what you want. But, you know, guys, if I'm honest with you, what you want is like the king of pentacles. That's like way up there. Imagine wanting Taeyangi. I mean, we all want him, right? <laughs> so we have this goal of marrying him. Like everyone wants to marry him, you know? So if you're not at this goal yet, you would probably totally understand why, because it's not like it's a way to climb and it's um, <laughs> it's not that everyone can marry or Tiangi, you know, it's um, but imagine this is like the goal you want and this could be whatever, whatever you have in mind. Your goal is very high up. It could be that you're saying, well, I want to be um. I want to be a doctor and you just started to study and then you know, you know, as a person, you know, well, if you study to become a doctor, it takes like years, like seven, eight years. And you're like maybe in your first year and you're feeling this lack energy or no, not in your first year. You would be here in your fifth year and you were saying, oh my gosh, you know, I'm tired of this lack energy. I still have to climb so much and the path is so long that you feel tired along the way. <laughs> Look at this art. You feel tired along the way. It's like you're moving towards a goal that is really high up. This goal is not like I want to buy a bicycle. This goal is like, I don't know, I want to have my dream job or I want to marry this guy. Like, you know, I want to meet Taeyangi. Those are those goals. And no wonder, you know, that um, you're not there yet. You know, your goal is very high up, but you don't see it that way. You don't see it that your goal is way up and you, you, of course, you need a long time. Like, I mean, in the examples that I gave, it's very clear to everyone that, of course, you cannot reach such a goal in like two or three years. But here it's like you thought you can reach the goal in a shorter time than actually what you need. And that's why you're in this energy of, hello, where's my, where's my, my treat? Why am I not getting there? I thought I'm on the way. You know, and you, this is an energy of um, not feeling confident enough. It's exactly, you know, I feel that Jiminy really represents very good this, thank you, <laughs> this um, solar plexus chakra because Jiminy struggled with that too a long time, you know, but now he's so confident and he's saying, well, I made it, you know, he's saying, and even if I'm still on the journey, I still want to improve myself. I can be happy. I can be cheerful. I can see how on the way, how much I already have done. So this is what I'm feeling here. Very much an energy of, you know, give yourself some time out on your reaching of your goal. Give yourself some time out to, for yourself. Um, try to cheer up on the path, wherever you want to lead to, uh, wherever you want to go to. Let's see what the dice is saying. I just grab... Okay, we have the tree. See, this stands for growth. So even if you don't see it, there's growth there. And the fountain is like joy. Like what, you know, it's basically emphasizing this again. While you're growing, while you're reaching your goal, while you're walking on your journey, it also could be your spiritual journey. Learn to enjoy, you know. The fountain is enjoy the emotions, especially enjoy your life. Um, be happy with everything, you know, don't feel this lack energy so much because here it's like you're very pressured by this lack energy. I want to get as an end energy. I want to get an, um, yeah, like a, how do you say, like an affirmator, affirmator, an affirmation for you, <laughs> an affirmator. What am I saying? It's like Terminator. <laughs> Mm. 
So guys, I got the deck, now we're getting your affirmation, the affirmation for yourself. Ow, so. Okay, universe, give me an affirmation for this. Give me an affirmation. It says each person is part of the harmonious whole. With joy, I recon recognize my perfection and the perfection of life. Look at this. This is the affirmation. Exactly. Look at this with joy this is what you have to tell yourself because you're you're constantly moving yourself or keeping yourself stuck into this um energy of lack you know and it's saying playfulness lightheartedness innocence wonder you know get out of this moody feeling of you're not enough or you're not good enough or you will never reach your dreams that's stupid you know say each person is part of the harmonious whole with joy, I recognize my perfection and the perfection of life. I only want to get one more. One more universe. I accept all of myself. I really love those. The work I do on myself is not a goal. It is a process. Look at this. A lifetime process. I choose to enjoy. This is crazy. Look at this, guys. Exactly. It's not about the goal. It's not reaching this King of Pentacles. Um, well, it is, of course, about the goal of one day having this marriage you want. But, you know, you won't marry the guy you want if you constantly only try to reach one thing, you know. Because along the journey, when you're happy, you will meet this person. Along the journey, um, you know, to your goal, to your dream job. You will see that, you know, everything. And look how the cards the, the are the same color. This is not like for everything. You see? Beautiful. I really love this. You guys need to see that everything is made of, of joy. And I also want to get one of those pop-up dream cards for you guys. So I'm going to draw one here. I want this one. So... And I open them extra for you. This is called Dream. So it says, Don't wait to be discovered. See? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Enjoy the process. You know, walk the process. Be happy. Um, don't sit around and in this lack energy and tell yourself, well, I have to wait, you know, I'm, I'm sitting here and I'm waiting. One day I will reach it. You already planted your new life. You know, you started something and it's time now to walk and to walk with joy and not constantly keep you waiting here in this lag energy that someday something happens. You know, this is also a very, very um, good advice, I feel. Very good. I really love this. That, that was a cute reading from our Jiminy. I hope you like this, guys. Okay, bye.